the peace plan announced last week, which acknowledges Israel's heritage and historical heritage as a nation state, not, a, not only a modern state, but a historical state. Do you think that uh, uh, this new attitude, this new approach, uh, would affect uh, uh, the European nations, their attitude towards Israel? The Europeans is a very, very complicated attitude towards Israel, but in general, in today's European politics, the more nationalist a political party is, the more sympathetic it is to Israel. Israel, Israel is a, is a, a classical uh, independent national state, maybe even the classical independent national state. It's the original biblical model for, 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 for the, the nations of Europe to, to be independent. And uh, uh, I, I, I certainly think that uh, that Israel um, uh, inspires uh, uh, European nationalists, and European nationalists will uh, re return the favor by wanting to to, to participate and, and help Israel. I think that's true. Thank you very much. Sure, thank you. I'm sorry. Congratulations to the conference. It's been great. Blessing. Professor Hazoni, what's your takeaway from today? Um, we have a, a, a rising tide of exciting, excited, decent, um, uh, and intellectually uh, curious uh, nationalists on this continent. I'm glad to begin meeting them. I'd like to meet more. Thank you very much. And what?